He turned, him. <laughs> he turned around. He turned around, bit that. <laughs> he, he looked at him. He like Tyrese ain't the only one that finds your ass delicious. <laughs> Give me some of that. T- that shit turned to a Cuban zombie movie. <laughs> 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 Hey everyone, support our Patreon, which helps us to continue bringing you our live streams, videos, and podcasts while bringing you new content such as exclusive live streams and animated shorts. Do it fast, do it furious. We have been doing that for a while. You know, I'm, uh, we have uh, F9. We saw it. Yeah. But we haven't reviewed it yet. I've kind of seen it twice. In a oh, way. so you were at the screening? Uh, no, I was at home for the first time. Oh. <laughs> I knew it. I had to put that boot on that leg. <laughs> but I wasn't. Gonna, I wouldn't admit that if I wouldn't have gone to the screening because I okay. did go to oh, the yeah. screening. Okay, so you did. Okay, I was I there. Yeah. I was there. So you know, everybody's kind of prepping themselves because they were saying that, yeah, look, we've had little drops and dribbles here of getting people back to the theater, but this is the one hey, that ben, everybody is ben really. Diesel told everybody to go back. Yeah, he had that tank top on, so you know he he went <laughs> right, Yeah. <laughs> Go back. <laughs> it's time to go back. <laughs> like you said, he had that tank top on, so he was anywhere. Yeah, <laughs> he, he, he existed, <laughs> right? So, so he was awake. Is that? You know what I'm talking about? Hit that. Talk about family. That's his closest family. Yeah. That goddamn tank top. Fucking good man at a wedding. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> With a tie on. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. One of those chipping yeah. ties. Yeah. But a white With a tank wife beater. <laughs> Will you get dressed up? I am dressed. <laughs> you should keep up. Yeah, but people, we're celebrating. Going back to the theater with the one that they said. They said, we told you, this is going to be the one to bring people back. This is going to be the one to save cinema. God <laughs> 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 damn, man. Mm, that ain't right. <laughs> you look, I'm, <laughs> I'm looking at this. I like the way they looked in the back seat and saw nothing but teeth. <laughs> <laughs> you look at that and... Uh, like I said, you know, in this world, physics don't exist no more. Gravity, they just, they both left about three movies yeah. ago. <laughs> Shit, physics looked at gravity and said, man, come on, man. Yeah, clearly, we're not wanted <laughs> yeah. here. Shit, they don't appreciate us, man. Let's go. And nobody listen to us around here, no way. <laughs> Shit, Fast and Furious put gravity and physics out of a job. Yeah. <laughs> Shit. And I like how magnets were like, well, I'm going to stick around and see how this works yeah. out. <laughs> no, don't, no, you don't want to do that, man. You don't want to do that. All right, we tried to tell you. Shit. <laughs> Magnets are showing up in the unemployment line looking at physics and gravity. Who told you, man? Shit, gr- physics and gravity on food stamps right now. Nah. <laughs> but there was a time, believe it or not, when physics and gravity, they were part of the series. Yeah. And at that time, people were, they were human. I mean, you know, Hollywood human. But still. But still somewhat mm-hmm. relatively human. I said that the other day when I was they talking were about. They were rules. <laughs> and I, and you know something, it's, 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 you think. It's funny, man. This series has morphed and turned and uh-huh. evolved, devolved, and just mutated into, into something so crazy that if you drop out just once, it's like you went into a coma. It's like you went. It's like it's like it's like you went to space and came back to Earth and shit. What the fuck is happening here? It's so fun to watch F nine with people who had only seen the first one. Yeah. Oh wow. Well, man, I I see this this, this for me. I missed two of them, and they were kind of two important like links in the chain. It's it's funny how and there was a time when it felt like they weren't, but they have since gone back and done stuff where you're like, all right, well now you you got to watch these. It's it's like like with the Infinity War. Uh, and um, the uh, end game. Well, where- even with this, it's like if you miss any of those early films, mm-hmm. even if you've seen the later films, even if you've been going with this series for a while, I'm telling you, if you miss a couple of the movies early on, that shit is like coming out of a, a cryo chamber or something. Yeah. But now we are moving on to the one where. Moving back. Moving back, yeah. Well, I'm moving. For me, it's moving on, but we're going to step back in the series. You are correct, timeline, yeah. because we are talking about Too Fast, Too Furious, the one that came right after the one that shook up the world, the first one, the first Fast and Furious. Mm-hmm. This one is minus Vin Diesel, but got your boy Paul Walker in there as Brian. <laughs> <laughs> Brian O'Connor. You Brian O'Connor. You don't know his name. They say it like that. No. <laughs> you can't hear it. <laughs> but what they did was, it's like they took, they took a. a a person of color and kind of broke him down in the two and got ludicrous and and, uh, and John, and, uh, not John Singleton, but uh, this guy directed it, but Tyrese. Tyrese, It's yeah. the introduction of Tyrese mm-hmm. here. 
Uh, yeah, him and Ludacris. Him, him and yeah. Ludacris. Roman and Tej. Yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. This, this will be, or this was, as of this morning. This was my, this was my first time watching Too Fast, Too. One of the things that I noticed with Tokyo Drift, and I noticed it with this, especially as you say, with Tokyo Drift coming after Too Fast, Too Furious. Yeah. Uh, some things, some slight things, haven't aged too well. You, some things you can't, you can't do today. <laughs> some things you can't do today. Now, and and I mentioned this in Tokyo Drift because Tokyo Drift opened up. They opened up with them lynching an, an, a Native American. <laughs> Now, it wasn't a real one, but that don't matter today. Yeah. You, can't, you can't do that That's shit today. Sharing the shit. Sharing the yeah. shit. Yeah, kill them, yeah. red motherfuckers. Yeah, <laughs> yeah man. <laughs> and if, but that wasn't uh, that wasn't as uh, <laughs> not nearly as bad as what some people might find offensive with this. Because this movie, the beginning of the, the beginning of this, opens up with them swooping in and sexually assaulting women. Man. Oh yeah. Yeah. The, uh, right. Uh, I don't even think we have the, the the opening title yet, and some dude just going in, just grabbing ass. That's it, baby. Sigan brillando. Esto es mío. Yeah. Oh. Yes. He's not even grabbing asses. He's grabbing perineums. He's, he's yeah. right down in he, there. He is up in that yeah. right there. He is. That fool is in. I'm I'm surprised he didn't come back up with shit on his fingers. Exactly. <laughs> <laughs> But the, the camera follows it in. Oh, yeah. And usually when you see something like that, the girl goes, oh, yeah. and slaps it. She's all yeah. hot giggle. God damn. And I ain't making excuses for him. I'm just saying there's just so much ass in this movie. Like, like everywhere you go, there's just ass everywhere, man. Yeah. Like if you I mean that is Miami. Though. That is Miami too, but like shit, if you like if you trip and fall, you're gonna face plant in ass. Yeah. At least you got cushion. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> They got so much ass here, man. Now I don't know if you're gonna be able to hear it here. I, but if you, because I'm listening on speakers that might not be able to pull it through, but y'all might be able to hear it at home if you hear it carefully. I'm not even making this up. They got so much ass in here. I think one of them chicks farted. Like listen, nah. like listen. I mean, I'm not even trying to be childish. Just, just listen real quick. We might not hear it, but you might. Just listen. Oh, come on, man. That wasn't no fart. Like a record yeah. scratch. Did you hear that, y'all? Listen. Everybody got to ruin that beautiful scene for me. Y'all hear that? Y'all hear that? Yeah, them pants just a little bit too tight right there. Uh, so this takes place in Miami, directed by the great John Singleton, who is no longer with us, so rest in peace yeah. on that. Mm -hmm. Uh but at the time, he was tasked with carrying on the Fast and Furious franchise, and he wanted to take it from one, uh, from one coast to the other. First one was in L.A., mm -hmm. decided to take this to Miami. And it makes sense. It does, because you have uh, one character who was on the run. I got to tell you, man, uh, it was for, for somebody who, I mean, listen, whether you like these or not, you've been with these characters for a long time. I realize that. Between watching F9 and watching this one, I was like, been with these guys a long time. Been with them for 20 years. 20 years. 20 yeah. years. Yeah. He was on today's show this morning talking all about it. <laughs> yeah. yeah, man, we've been with these dudes and these girls for a long time, man. So, you know, it was, it was man, it was, it was, it was sad and it was cool to see Brian again, man. Brian, uh, Brian, pull up in here. Yeah, I was like, wow, it's good seeing old Brian and Paul Walker, man. Yeah. So I was, in addition to John Singleton being, being gone, man, a lot of like, uh, it's a bittersweet film to watch, sure. man, with, with these with these people sure. being uh, being uh, no longer around. Well, plus, you know, it, like you always think of you know, Vin Diesel as a show, but having Paul, Paul Walker or Brian roll up in this, it gave me that feeling like, you know what, I really did like Brian in that first movie. It's, it's good to just... Just spend time with him. I like. I do like yeah. him in the first one. I liked him a lot in the yeah. first one. I didn't think I yeah. was going to either. Yeah, sure. no, I, so. I I like Brian too, man. And Brian's no longer police officer. He's on kind of on the run, kind of in a way. He's not not officer yeah, anymore. He's, yeah, he's been busted. He's in Miami. Yeah, he just that life got to him too good, man. <laughs> I love it. Like, wait, so the guy we sent you to capture, you had him. 
and instead you not only let him go, but you gave him your car keys. Right. Yeah. Yeah. Maybe that wasn't so good. So anyway, I'm gonna get on my next case. <laughs> like, yeah. yeah uh-huh. Your next case is out the door. Yeah. You're fucking fired. <laughs> Wait a minute. You had him and let him go. He had no fucking awesome, right? <laughs> <laughs> Fuck out of here. Right? Yeah. 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 <laughs> but the way that he did some EDI men shit on him in the first one, like like, <laughs> like, like just charmed him into oh, yeah. the love of the oh, life. Yeah. Oh, yeah. He yeah, stole totally his ass. Right. Yeah, right. Yeah. He's like he's like getting the keys. Yeah. He, he sucked his dick too. Yeah. Shit. Well, what was I supposed to do before he left? I mean. What was I supposed to do? Had to say goodbye. <laughs> Shit. Shit, he made that white boy feel cool. Man. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Had him out there with all the with all, all them minorities, all, the, all them beautiful brown people. Yeah, mm-hmm. he, he went native. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> as they like to say. Though, as much as it is as cool as it is to see to see Brian, man, he still. He still looks like a, He's like still a goofy he, st- he still looks like a rich white kid trying to act black. <laughs> he sure does. What's up, Tush? What's happening, dude? Ah, oh, you know, funky fresh. Yeah. <laughs> Man, Don't. for real. It's like, it's like, how many takes did that go? It was like, it was like okay. Oh my God. Okay, so listen. <laughs> Jump, just don't. Do that again. <laughs> What's up, Tush? Why you, okay, that's, that's you know, Luda? <laughs> I mean, I'm just it's pretty fly out here. <laughs> that fist bump didn't even go right, yeah, man. Yeah. <laughs> Luda was like, let, let me go ahead and meet this motherfucker halfway. Yeah, 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 man, shit. Just grab his fist for him. Yeah, yeah, yeah. God damn it, shit. We ain't shooting this shit again. He's just smiling out goofy. Hey, yeah. Ludacris. <laughs> What's up, Tush? Hey. Hat, man, dude. Oh, it's up. awesome, buddy. <laughs> <laughs> Man, it's pretty dark out here, am I right? Yeah. Oh, Brian, don't. <laughs> so, uh, any of these people dangerous? <laughs> Man, you know it's good to uh, it's good seeing him and good seeing some other people I didn't even know in the movie because I never seen this before. Right, right. Some uh, some faces that I that I uh, that I recognize. There's some actors that I like. So I didn't know that. For one, I didn't know that 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 Michael Ely. Was yeah. in this Michael Ely who plays a character named Slapjack. This is Michael Ely. <laughs> I think this is Michael Ely with the biggest fro I've ever seen him. I seen Michael Ely with some big hair. This is the first time I seen Michael Ely with an afro though. Oh, girl, sorry. Damn, what's she doing <laughs> here? That shit snap, crackle, and pop. When she pulled that shit out, you hear that? <laughs> <laughs> he's like he's gonna slap her for real. Yeah, yeah, yeah like, he, like he, he wasn't even acting anymore. Yeah, yeah. Bitch, like, what the on. fuck you doing? <laughs> That shit, she pulled that, did y'all hear that shit crinkling when she pulled that shit? What you do? I be mad too. Oh, girl, sorry. Shit, I think I saw sparks flying out when she did that. <laughs> God damn it. That makes me mad, because you know why? Because it reminds me when my mother used to comb my hair when I was yeah, little. Yeah. Shit, y'all used oh, to. Oh, boy, that is all hurt. Hell yeah. Look at him, all his play acting. Stop, stop, stop crying. Yeah. <laughs> Although he, <laughs> Although, now, I ain't even touching you. Why are you still crying? <laughs> Although his nappy headed ass is grown. <laughs> so, yeah. so he's going, that's all him. It's only on goddamn hair. Yeah. Shit, I, reminds me of my mother's kid. It was almost like trying to start a fire. <laughs> just, yeah. Rubbing, <laughs> rubbing <laughs> shit together. You just see sparks and sparks and smell of smoke and shit. Pig is bent. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> him and, uh, and this chick, I hadn't seen this chick in too many things, but I did recognize her from a couple of things. Uh, Devin Aoki. Yeah. Devin A- Aoki, who's mm. you recognize her because she's gorgeous and she also has just a unique face. Also, she she's that she's an heiress to the Benny Hana yeah. fortune. Right, right. Reading that, I was like, oh, so that must be where uh, Tyrese got his connection. Yeah, that's why he got a that's why he got a personal Benny Hanna's uh-huh, man. Uh-huh. Courtesy of this chick yeah. right here. I really don't. You know what? When, let me ask you something. Mm. When, cause you saw it. Oh yeah. What did you think about it when you saw it a long time ago? When I saw it a long time ago, it was fresh off of seeing the first movie, and I was really down on just the like the the drop in quality with different mm-hmm. things. Like you loved that first one. I did. I did, and I I didn't like how like the the uh, the CG and the green screen is a lot sloppier, mm-hmm. um, and the story is not as tight. It's kind of refreshing to rewatch. I was like, you know what? I'm kind of back on Billy's side. Where, okay, I'm, I'm digging this. <laughs> Although, I think this movie is rough in the beginning. Because, like, yeah, this opening scene with them, oh, yeah. all these characters are so exaggerated in their oh, yeah. ethnicity. Oh, it's yeah. like, they're all cartoon characters yeah. when it opens up. I was like, Well, well Martin has come around, but he has seen it before. With me, how did I feel? Well, we'll get into that in a little bit. One of the things that you brought up that I do agree with you on, uh, CG in this, boy. CG... Seats, the, the CG is so crazy in this that it looks like an anime. Yeah. I mean, 
mean, when I was it's looking, it's like, like like Speed Racer. It it is just like Speed Racer. That's the first thing I thought of. I was oh, like, yeah. this is another Speed Racer right here. Shit, you're like, wait a minute, put on Speed Racer then. <laughs> yeah. I was like, no, that is. <laughs> wait a minute, that ain't, that ain't Fast and Furious no more. <laughs> having a seizure. <laughs> Man. Yeah, man. It look it's it, <laughs> where before they got stunts in here, but there is so much more CG. So much more in this right here. If you it, can see it, it, it just when, when they bring you. And I haven't seen this since it came out, but mm -hmm. I just remember them bringing you into the car, and I'm like, take me out. This cheap ass CG. Yeah. I don't yeah. need to come. I don't need to come in there with Brian and all these other people. Yeah, because it just looks so shiny yeah. and weird, and I don't know. And the, you know, one of the things that listen, you just have to accept it in this world, uh, because I. It's a big jump from the first movie and how these racers, like the racers were still underground the first movie. Here, they talk about underground, but these motherfuckers have taken over the town. Well, plus, it's Miami, and you know what Miami is like. It's a party city at it's night. It's a party and city, yet, yeah. Somehow they have found abandoned streets. They, they, they just yeah. put up a sign that says road closed, and there's nobody, there's nobody out there before they even put the sign up. Right. No, there's no one out there, and these motherfuckers, man, they, they got... They got more access to the cities than actual city employees <laughs> yes. are officials. The roots of how crazy this property w w is, is was going to go was already kind of shown in the second yeah, second yeah, movie oh, right sure, here. Yeah. So these fools get out there in the middle of the, uh, of the night, ain't nobody around, ain't nobody partying, and they just start taking shit over. They <laughs> tell the motherfuckers raise the drawbridge. <laughs> right. Told y'all I had a surprise. How you like that for a finale? <laughs> ain't nobody around. You can't do this, man. No, no, no. you can't. <laughs> Sorry, I know you're supposed yes. to suspend belief, but you can't do this I shit. I told y'all I had a surprise, man. Yeah, you full of shit, Because they do some kind of heist to take over <laughs> the bridge. I'm like, yeah, you, you can't do You know, it would make more sense if here, Ludacris was the computer genius. He turns right. out and hacked the bridge. And hacked right. the bridge, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> but thus drawing all kinds of attention to yourself by the authorities. Yeah. Hey, that bridge yeah. ain't supposed to be going up. <laughs> right. No, these motherfuckers are just, they're just hoodlums who just know every inch of the city and every and know what, every button and every lever to pull. Every button to press. And they do all this just so they can just do some of the dumbest things, like the do all this Dukes of Hazard shit. I love that. They're like, just, <laughs> all explosions. <laughs> just, the, the car just falls apart. Wheels going. <laughs> to, 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 to win $10,000, I just did $15,000 of damage yeah, on my right. car. Well, <laughs> and risked my life. Well, what she did was she went, she went and put that vagina up in the ludicrous face. Yeah. Like, oh, baby, let me get that for you. <laughs> yeah, right. <laughs> yeah, I guess she always figured like, I'm going to come out of this, okay? <laughs> yeah, let, let me get that front end for you. <laughs> Meanwhile, he ain't never got her front end. She just keep playing his ass. <laughs> I think it's smack that ass. <laughs> She's, yeah, she yeah, smacked that ass. That don't make no sense. <laughs> I like Dorito said, fuck this. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> I like the, the, the dumbest guy who end up being the smartest right. guy. <laughs> Dorito said, hell no. Nah. <laughs> you know, folks, snack chip, I'm pretty smart. <laughs> you know what's funny? That's when that Coke start wearing off. Yeah. <laughs> you go like that in the beginning. You're like, oh, fuck, what am I doing? Oh, shit. <laughs> <laughs> what am I doing? Yeah. I like, oh, fuck, what am I doing? What am I? <laughs> <laughs> Meanwhile, like your bitch. girl, the Coke just kicked in. Yeah. <laughs> The car gets fucked up, but also the way she delivers that line so desperately. Smack that ass! It's like, wait, are you having a good time or what? Because that's not. No! Can't you tell? Yeah. I can't. Some people, like, that's how you know she, she's all drugged up because she's just saying shit out of her ass. Yeah. Some people be like, I regret nothing! <laughs> you know, but no, nah, she's just saying what the fuck ever. And even she's kind of confused why she's saying it. Look at her. Like, huh? What the fuck? What? What? what the fuck did you say? <laughs> what did he give me? <laughs> it's funny, man, because they do, man, they they are all they are all crazy doing this race, man. I love the way Brian. Cause Brian tries to act all street. But when Brian gets behind that wheel and ain't nobody around, he's goofy as goofy. fuck. Goofy. <laughs> 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 only and you know funny thing here is man only after they're done racing tearing up the city crashing in a product placement oh, 
Boy, oh, they keep the camera on Pepsi. Pepsi they you kept you, it on you Pepsi. didn't see Michael Ely anymore. No, right? you <laughs> see Pepsi. You saw Pepsi. So I'm surprised a, a giant can of Pepsi just didn't pop over and lean on him and just pour all over there. Right, right. And he'd go, ah. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Some garbage pill kid shit right Man, there. Man, I was about to say, between, between Fast and Furious and Garbage Pill Kids. Hey, we're the Pepsi generation. Shit, Pepsi don't give a Pe- Pepsi some hoes. Yeah, yeah. Pepsi. You got those fucking creatures coming out with yeah. the Pepsi talking about that's gonna sell a- if you, you know, you can edit this in Fast and Furious and not even know the difference. <laughs> <laughs> you know, after crashing the product placement, tearing up the city, doing all this crazy shit, and after they in after they win the race, then the police decide right, to right. show up. It's time to get out of here. What's that? <laughs> Wait, where's everybody going? I love it. Brian's the last one. Brian, Brian. Hey, what happened? Wait, what, what is that sound? <laughs> yeah, you know why? Because I'm a BR. Yeah. <laughs> Go ahead, run. Run, Negroes, yeah. run. Yeah. Run, you brown people. Run, you brown ass motherfuckers gone. That's how you know he ain't street. <laughs> he been lying, talking about grew up in the street. No, you didn't. He didn't know yeah. what the siren was. Yeah, exactly. He never heard one before. Yeah. Oh, hey, hey, the party's just getting started, guys. Where you going? <laughs> hey. <laughs> Somebody in the chat said, oh, shucks, the popo. <laughs> oh, I love, damn. Because you, 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 you say, man, he, you know, his blue eyes and his blonde hair got him out of trouble. No, because his dumb ass stayed behind. He got, he's the one that got caught. He's the, one that got caught. He's the main yeah. one that got caught. And uh, in, in the movie, it was fucking the movie tried to even make him look stupid. Ain't <laughs> <laughs> hey, nothing like a crossfade oh. to make your ass look dumb. Oh, y'all really going to do me like this. <laughs> You know what's funny because <laughs> this shit, this looks like the end of a drunk driving commercial. It does. <laughs> yeah. A documentary. Have you been drinking? <laughs> Don't drink and drive. <laughs> that's where the story kicks in, man. Because that's where Brian gets his big, fast, and furious mission. Sure. There, you know, it goes. That's the, not, the missions. The missions always start this way. We need you to do this <laughs> incredibly dangerous mission, and if you do it, we'll wipe your record. Yeah, you know, always. Like, always. Yeah. Oh, is reinstate him too, though. No, no, no. They don't oh, mention that. No, they, they don't. They, oh, okay. no, they do not want his ass back. They, okay. they just, they just say, you'll, you'll be square. We'll, we'll forget about that shit you did in L.A. That mm-hmm. sure is it. That okay. sure is it. Yeah, the feds come in. They say, hey, look, we're trying to always capture some big bad boss out there. This time, they're trying to capture. They're trying to capture uh, the head of a big drug cartel. Carter Verone. Born in Argentina, but he's lived most of his life in Miami. Bullshit. Carter Monroe ain't nobody. V- Verone. Carter, Carter Maron. Yeah, Maron, man, you a fucking lie. <laughs> That's bullshit. Verone. Carter, Carter Verone, Maron, whatever his name is. Carter's actually, he's a white dude in brown face named Cole Hauser. Half right, Jewish, yeah, dude. half Jew, born in Santa Barbara, California, Argentina. My ass, he's about as European as you can get. Ain't no Latin in his lineage at all. This, my man, is German, Irish, Belgian. On his uh, mother, and his mother's Jewish from Austria, Russia, and Poland. Grew up in California, Oregon, and Florida, and gonna put some goddamn shoe polish in his hair and a little little tan and say, Latin, get the fuck out of here. You ain't gonna. Let, let, if you notice, they bring up, they bring back a lot of people. This is one villain you ain't going to see no more. Yeah. yeah. Unless they recast him. But it's funny because in the movie, at some point, he does try to bring out his, uh, he tries to bring out his, his, his inner Al Pacino. He tries to get his, his uh, there's just a few spots. He tries to get his Thorna Montana on. It's over. Let's go. Sour gun. Come on. Let's go. Let's, <laughs> let's, let's go. Start my Let's go. Now go. Let's go. <laughs> hey, you know what? We changed our mind. We don't want you doing it anymore. <laughs> yeah, just stop. This was, yeah, this is oh, oh, good because that was exhausting. <laughs> yeah, this is, this is like first day of shooting. <laughs> we ain't shooting no more. We're going to keep that, but don't do that no I'm more. I'm trying to find the character. That's not it. <laughs> stop, stop looking. <laughs> just, 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 just say just the fucking yeah, line. Just say, say the whole word. Just not, say the not go. Say go. It's fine. <laughs> and, he, and he really is. If you look at him, he's even trying to. He's even trying to look like Al Pacino. Look at him. Pulling in that bottom logo. The series brings a lot of people back. You ain't going to see him. But one of the people that they do bring back that we've seen over 
and over and over again. I'm going to tell you, man, uh, I'm talking about how it's good to see Brian and it's good to see some actors in here that I know were in there. It's cool watching this movie for the first time after all these years. You know, I haven't seen all these other films. But the real love for me, the real movie for me here is not the action movie that is marketed as, mm -hmm. but as the romantic comedy it is. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> People, we, on, okay, so on, we did a show yesterday where Oz and I talked about, we talked about how people should stop trying to force two guys who are in a scene together or in a movie together, in a show together, that you like. Stop trying to force them to be gay. <laughs> unless, <laughs> unless they're written that way, right. unless, it's, unless it's natural or uh -huh. organic. Don't try to retcon that shit into them to be in a relationship and be gay. Uh -huh. You know what I'm saying? Uh -huh. I said yesterday... Uh, Han Solo was not fucking Chewbacca, all right? Let's, right, right, let's stop right. doing this shit. Um, you know, like I said, it should, it should not be forced. It should come naturally. But I'm going to tell you what. They ain't forcing shit here, and it comes very naturally. <laughs> right. Y'all going to be... Might, not everybody's going to be happy with what we're saying here. I'm sorry, but fuck it. Here we go, man. This is the movie where we get introduced to Roman, mm -hmm. played by Tyrese Gibson. Mm hmm now, they say apparently Brian and Roman, they say that if you listen to, to Brian, Brian says, if you want to, even that's a stretch. But he said, yeah, me and Roman, we, uh, we grew up back in the hood together. All right, O'Connor. Who you got in mind? This dude I grew up with in Barstow. Okay. You grew up with him. Cool. In but Bar through the whole film, you get the feeling that they're not telling us everything. Mm -hmm. They're not telling us what really happened back in Barstow or whatever they, they were raised. They picked the whitest hood, by the way, in, in California. <laughs> is it? Barstow, yeah, yeah, Barstow's like the white South Central. Oh, okay. It's where all the red... Oh. <laughs> so they, they, they knew better than they really go to the hood. They were like, somebody came, okay. single, they came and said, nah. It's like, okay. Yeah, come on, yeah. Yeah, I was wondering. Barstow, Thank motherfucker, you. yeah. Because yeah. I was wondering about that. I was yeah. like, I'm not buying this, yeah. but, but man... <laughs> I'm going to tell y'all, man, listen, this is one of the greatest gay movies of all time. Yeah. If y'all want to, it's unofficial, but it is truly one of y'all's biggest first gay action flicks out yeah, there, they, man. They, 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 don't, they don't name it. You have to read between the lines, but it ain't that hard. <laughs> it ain't, it, man, I'm telling y'all, y'all want to get, listen. If, if, <laughs> if, if you were to ever see the movie Chuck and Buck and then watch this, you go like, oh, I totally see what's happening. Yeah, y'all going to be mad at us for saying this right here. Some of y'all going to be like, man, you forcing this. You see what you want. You just trying to tell jokes. <laughs> this ain't no joke. This ain't nothing. The love between Brian and Ty Tyrese, Roman, that is no joke, y'all. It's, it's all the sexual tension oh, until they finally get past it. Man, <laughs> the moment... The moment Brian shows up and came back into Ro the, the moment Brian shows up and and, and 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 brings his way back into Roman's life, it's almost like it's like it's like Roman's conflicted about it. He's like, I'm so mad at you, but. Damn, you still fine as hell. It's, it's, it's like, like the end of Moonlight. Yeah. yeah, yeah. It is, like, it is, it, that is the look of seeing that person who broke your heart. That mm -hmm. it took you a long time to get over. It's, and you thought you weren't going to see sure. them again. And you weren't even thinking about up. it. You thought you were over it. And out of nowhere, there they are. You know, it's like you thought it's like you ain't seen them for a while. And it's like, well, maybe I dodged a bullet. They probably fat now. Yeah. <laughs> they probably not like they used to be. And came back like, fuck, you be, you look even better than you did back then. God damn. Roman got a heart on right now. <laughs> he like, shit, this motherfucker stayed fine. And also can't call. Not they can't, yeah. show they, up without a call. Yeah, yeah. They were mad at each other. Exactly. Years. Don't do me like got, that. I got the nerve to show up at my job. At first, I was afraid. I was petrified. <laughs> right. <laughs> but Strum now you're back. Right. <laughs> from outer space. Strum on my pain with this finger. <laughs> he don't know what he's feeling right no, now. I'm mad at you, but I'm horny as fuck right now. God he, he was you, mad, bro. but something else took over, yeah. boy. Because right. he was like, why are you doing this to a <laughs> brother right here? <laughs> Let me just see if I can play this the right way. Yeah. <laughs> Shit, motherfucker. <laughs> Let me just see what he wants. <laughs> Less than a minute. These two, 
they can't keep their hands no. off each other. That is a lover's quarrel. That ain't no... Because dudes, when they fight, they... Fuck off me! Yeah. Fuck right. off me! They like... Oh, oh. <laughs> they wrestling like 12-year-olds and shit. Yeah. I want to fight you, but I want that body on me. So you guys are going to just roll around, and then you're eventually going to kiss. No! No. Well, no, we told you we can't do that. <laughs> Come on, just uh, let's do it. Maybe. They're right here. They're right in. Still fight like shit. Still fight like shit. I hate you. Oh. I hate you. You got to chill. Like, <laughs> look, he like yeah, shit. Yeah, this yeah. is hot. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I ain't gay, but shit. Yeah. <laughs> you know what you hope something's gonna happen? It actually, yeah. does. <laughs> ah, shit. like uh, I ain't no homo, but these two pretty motherfuckers ready. <laughs> Don't get that ass. <laughs> shit, I'm gonna watch this. Maybe some draws get pulled off. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> You know, you know Your whole day just comes together. <laughs> Shit. The funny thing is, because you look at this, funny thing is, nobody was even selling popcorn around there, but he found some. Yeah, he sure did. Just the case. That motherfucker had his own bag of popcorn ready. And uh, man, they are, they they're cute. It's not just sexual. Yeah. They they are cute, man. They they argue. They argue like a couple. They do. This deal legit. That's right. You do this job for us. Told you. Shut up. Shut up. It's <laughs> adorable. That's adorable. Yeah, I, know. I know. I know. They're like, like, like two little kids. Uh, or brothers. Yeah, all lovers. Yeah. No <laughs> See, this is what I'm talking about. I hear you right now. I do. I know y'all well enough. Man, y'all reaching. Y'all see what you want to see. You forcing it. Y'all just want to be funny. You just telling jokes. And by the way, y'all ain't funny. You know, it's just how friends act. Shit, boy, y'all... Y'all better than this. Fuck you. <laughs> I understand where you're coming from, but let me tell you something. I, w I would even give it to you right here. At this point, I would be like, okay, we are. We, maybe we are reaching a little bit. But when even Mendez enters the picture, done. <laughs> 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 Confirmed. Stamped. Because when she shows up and Brian's like, well, hey, Tyrese is all, what are you doing? You, yes, this fool is jealous. Why are you looking man? at her? This this fool is jealous. People, when when Eva Mendez shows up, listen. Before, okay, friends, sure, they're arguing, really, just you know, just uh, <laughs> they're just bros. But when Eva shows up, Roman gets just a little bit too possessive. <laughs> he did the stare and drive on you, didn't he? He got that from me. <laughs> when I did it to him. <laughs> but, wait, but wait a minute, look at this. Like he's, he, yeah, just, he looks like he goes back in. Yeah, he just, yeah. Yeah, he <laughs> he's just, about to pout. Yeah. Oh, yeah. He was mad and drove up and looked and watched this, y'all. Stay and drive on you, didn't he? He got that from me. <laughs> Even men is like, y'all fucking? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> look at this. She's like, she like, Brian, you want to tell me yeah, something? Yeah. <laughs> what, what, what aren't you telling me? What was that all about? Uh, so <laughs> we, like, what the fuck was that? Uh, like, so I we, don't we, know. Brian's like, we, are, Eva's just looking at Brian like, oh, oh, are we just friends then? <laughs> what? You, didn't, you didn't tell me you had a man. <laughs> he's like, he stays on Eva Mendez's ass. He's, he's, he, it's like he's constantly reminding Brian and her. He's reminding everybody, looking at Brian, talking about, bitch, don't forget, you mine. What you checking her out for? I'm not checking her out. <laughs> <laughs> That's like, what you checking her out for? It, it, it's it's obvious, right? That, oh, oh. And sorry. by the way, that's what the boyfriend would say when getting caught by his girlfriend. Uh -huh. I, I, I'm not I'm not checking her out because <laughs> again, if, they, if 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 this was a platonic relationship and both of them were straight, or at least if Brian was straight, mm -hmm. Brian would have said. Fuck, why not? You see that ass? Yeah. <laughs> Somebody like, I, I, I ain't looking at nothing. <laughs> it, it feels like they're both interested in her, and then they, they took that element of it out of the yes. script. Because it should be like, oh, what you check it out for? Look, man, that's mine. I told you that's mine. No, it's mine. Or, uh, are you trying to, you, oh, you yeah. in the car with so you trying to get up on me, and you say something about me? That kind of thing. They took that part of it out, or it's just like, why are you looking at her? Yeah. Because <laughs> I remember watching the first time thinking it was going to be, okay, the two of them Love want to get with her. Thing, right. And then you're like, wait. Roman ain't interested in her at all. No. He hates her. Roman He's constantly. Right. <laughs> Brian looking at Eva. <laughs> Eva looking at Brian. Mm. Br uh, uh, ain't nobody looking at Tyrese. Tyrese looking at both of them. Right. <laughs> and Tyrese looking at her like, bitch, stay away. With looking contempt. at Brian, bitch, you mine. Listen to this shit. This is how I do a respond. Mm. What you checking her out for? A dude who was straight would be like, why the fuck you worried about it? Yeah. Why, or, why ain't you looking at it? 
But no, he be looking at why you looking at her and Brown like I I I I I I, I, I. <laughs> don't do this now. <laughs> we'll talk about Not it later. The time I the said place. we'll talk about <laughs> it later. <laughs> yeah, time and place. <laughs> You and like, guys, you and when the three of them get together, he keeps his eyes on her like he's guarding property, man. That'd be cool. Sleep with the anime. And like her, she's like, she's like, I'm gonna ignore this motherfucker. She's like, <laughs> she's like, I'm trying to be cool, but you keep fuck with me, I'm gonna turn him out. <laughs> <Right>? <laughs> I don't even want I don't want neither one of y'all, but I'm gonna fuck him just to make you mad. Right. Now keep fucking with me. <laughs> <laughs> God damn it! That's a good. Thing. She's so fine in this movie. It's like you couldn't stay mad at her. No, <laughs> I wouldn't. Even, start, I wouldn't mad at her in the first place. I'm just saying, since you're gonna start eating that piece of fruit like that, I'd be like, uh, all right, yeah. look, I'm just kidding. <laughs> even she has to turn around and ask Brian, "The fuck is wrong with him?" Huh. I'm gonna go take a piss. You go do that. Yeah. Tell me what to do. What is his deal? I know he's great. I mean, I, I, I don't, I don't know. <laughs> he was like, "Yeah, right." He's got that kind of fire and passion you just can't find in anybody. I mean, uh, I mean he's an asshole. <laughs> like Brian been trying to act like he's ignoring him and like he's into this other chick, but you could tell that Brian he likes is, it. He's trying to. Tr Brian is trying his best to impress him because there are moments when, like, we already saw him try to act street around Ludacris and everybody else, but when he gets around. When he gets around Roman, he tries to get a little bit extra black. Drop it, I don't want to talk about it. Drop it, hell? I want to hear about this, homie. I said forget about it, cuz. <laughs> forget about uh, it, cuz. about it, cuz. You, you sound like Lucas Black then. Yeah. Forget about it, cuz. He actually put some bass in there. Oh, <laughs> he, if you look at it, he even put a little extra swag in there. So they, they dubbed a black dude's voice for that one line. Oh, that ain't I no dub. Forget about it. Forget about it, girl. Shit, that is him. Yeah. <laughs> I feel bad for that black dude if he, if he dubbed that for him. Drop it. I don't want to talk about it. Look at that extra strip swag he put in there. <laughs> like he got a pebble in his shoe or something. <laughs> but, but hell, I want to hear about this, homie. I said forget about it, cuz. <laughs> Did I turn you on? <laughs> <laughs> in all fairness, your boy Wahlberg does that when he's with black actors in movies. Like yeah. he, he kind of has that walk, but he puts it on when he's with black actors in the scene. Oh, but the only difference is <laughs> yeah. he ain't got Tyrese on his ass. <laughs> <That's true. laughs> yeah. You know what's funny, man? Because uh, you see Brian trying to impress Roman, but there's a moment where Roman is trying to make you can see him trying to make Brian jealous mm -hmm. because <laughs> this had me laugh because he tried to make Brian so jealous that he uh, he even grabs the mob boss's ass. Your pockets ain't nervous. Hey, hey. He's like, what the fuck you doing? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> what are you there for? <laughs> he trying to make Brian jealous. He like, <laughs> oh, but for real. Hey, he, it looked the way he even did. He was a little sweet when he did it. I said, your pockets ain't full. <laughs> yeah, all oh, pockets. Oh yeah, a little sweet. If you see that little Argentinian ass, yeah. you, you see the little, little body language you put in there. I said, you got something in your pocket, right? <laughs> Look at that little bulge. Your right front there. pocket. Your pockets ain't nervous. Hey. hey. And look at Brian. Brian like, look at him. Brian like, wait, what the fuck you doing, man? Yeah. <laughs> oh, so you Brian, do this, Brian man. spends a lot of that money going, <laughs> the fuck are you doing? Yeah. <laughs> I, I told you just be cool. Even when they're driving, man, talk about the sexual tension. Mm -hmm. Even when they're the stare down. Even when they're driving, these fools can't take their eyes off each other. Shit. Yeah, bro, man, he like them apples. Show off. That's the Brian O'Connor school driving right. I love you. <laughs> What'd you say? That's my man right there. <laughs> Both the dicks just rock hard. <laughs> <laughs> I enjoy this, man. There's even some things in here where a lot of people might complain. Uh, Cole House, I was talking about. I, I, you know, listen, you can't cast like that today. You just can't. All right. Nope. But. Uh, as far as hey, like, I ain't hating. I ain't, I ain't offended right now. What's done is done. Uh, <laughs> I, and I, you know, he's not the best villain that they have either. But there's some things he does that make sense. Sure. Like I like that he was auditioning drivers, and I thought at first like, okay, this is just to show off, just some more racing, and it was, and some more stunts. But <laughs> it was also, I said that makes sense because it was also a means of we now fucking idiots like <laughs> this yeah, guy. Right. I'm like, 
that dude is just fucking dead. He's dead. That and, dude and is dead. And they don't care. Nobody gives a shit. But I do like how it was realistic, though, because if he did hit that one, it, uh-huh. would, it would bounce yeah, him sure, back and sure. forth yeah. like that, where he would just it's, start losing control. It's yeah. actually a cool stunt. And, and I was just <laughs> laughing because all these drivers, they say experienced, you know, that was the one that lied. Yeah. That was the yeah. one. There's always somebody that was lied. That was his first day hanging with the big boys and trying. Wow. He's like, well, shit, I, I can do that, too. <laughs> They're looking like a pinball machine. (laughs) (laughs) Fuck. (laughs) He's gone. Yeah. Gone. That was a cool stunt, too. That was a terrific stunt, yeah. Villain, whatever the villain's name. Barone. Barone. Man, that was a... There was a moment here where he was threatening. He did some Game of Thrones shit. Where he, yes, he did. He, he took a rat, just pulled out a rat out of nowhere in the middle of the club and put it on this man's stomach. I mean, it's one thing to say, I'm going to put a rat in a bucket on your stomach, but then to take a blowtorch and start heating it up. Heating it up, yeah. They're going to heat up the rat so that the rat can actually try to escape so he can't go up. So, shit, he's going to go through your fat ass. <laughs> Shut up. Roman looking like, damn, I touched his ass too. <laughs> Shit. Maybe, maybe I shouldn't have done that. <laughs> maybe I need to keep my ass to myself. <laughs> yeah, right, because he steals his cigar cutter and gets caught. <laughs> and looking at that like, oh, yeah, that, that, that could have been me. That could have yeah. been some dark man shit. Yeah, yeah. Ro- yeah, yeah Roman exactly thinking like that's dark. him right now. And shit, oh, fuck, I'm next. <laughs> shit, Roman, when you going to learn, man? God damn. Maybe he'll put it in my ass. I don't know. <laughs> 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 Man, go <Come> on. <laughs> he puts, <laughs> he puts, <laughs> I was childish. He puts a bucket up to the naked ass. Eat that top. motherfucker yeah. up. It's only got one way to go. <laughs> yeah, that's it. And goddamn, Roman talking about hotter, man, hotter. Yeah. <laughs> I really like Tyrese in here too, man. Tyrese is uh, I'm gonna tell you, Tyrese, his <laughs> Tyrese, he's got he's got natural comedic talent. He does. He does. His comedic his comedic ad libbing here was extremely good, man. Especially with these henchmen. When he's, when he's, oh yeah. When he's capping <laughs> on these henchmen, I mean, it's not even it's not even an action movie. No, it's, it is a real comedy mm-hmm. at that point. Verone pay y'all to keep a straight face like that. Cause if I was making money, shit, I'd get that mole removed off my damn nose. That's not nice, man. <laughs> that hurts. Oh, that hurts on. my feelings, yeah. man. Yeah, man. You need to go there. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, my whole life I had this. <laughs> Why you say that, man? That hurts. But there is one scene where he didn't have to do that henchman like that. This is a scene that everybody knows. I'm like, damn, brother. You know, I mean, you had to do it. But you, you had to do it. <laughs> you had. You had to do it. But damn, man, you didn't. You didn't. You didn't have to make it racial like that. <laughs> Oh man! That stupid old gato, cuzzo, amigo. <laughs> and you know what? I love it too, man, because they they went the extra mile to 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 to, to humiliate that Cuban. Because they, you know, usually when they go through all the gears and the wires, they do that when they about to go racing. Right, right, right. They, they, put, they, they rigged up something special. They rigged up something special. They put production and CG into into ejecting that Cuban right there. <laughs> He didn't even put no thought in that. He just don't see no He just put O with yeah. it. <laughs> yeah, it's that Fred Sanford Spanish. Spanish. Yeah. He just don't see no cuzzo. Even the henchmen themselves had me laughing. Mo man had enough. He was fighting. He was fighting Brian, and he said, "Fuck trying to look cool or fight fair." He, he, he did turned, him. He turned around. He turned around. Bit that fool. <laughs> <laughs> he looked at him like Tyrese ain't the only one that finds your ass delicious. <laughs> Give me some of that too. That shit turned to a Cuban zombie movie. <laughs> What's the, the look on Brian's face? He's like, he's like, he's like, what the fuck is wrong with you? <laughs> Yeah, this ain't, this ain't the rules. Sounds like a man, goddammit. He like he like Roman. No bite, amigo. Yeah. If you 
got mad at us today and thought that we were looking too deep. We were reaching. We were pulling. We were just doing this because we're childish. Well, maybe it's Billy childish, you know. <laughs> <laughs> but, <laughs> but. <laughs> uh, what do you well, what do you say? <laughs> um, <laughs> but if y'all had any 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 doubt, at the end of this Tyrese out of this out of all this movie, this is where the end is where he pulls the ultimate cock block and lets Brian know I'm gonna never let your ass go. <laughs> mm. Yeah, I'm gonna have to stay out here in Miami, man. Keep you out of trouble, bruh. <laughs> the end. <laughs> yeah, you, you ain't never getting with her. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Not on my watch. Yeah. Shit. Well, it's damn my man. Yeah. Yeah, keep you out of trouble with me. That bitch. <laughs> yeah. We never mentioned that Tej was never a computer expert. No. Like no. you know, we did, we did say maybe he went and took some coding classes later yeah. or something. Yeah. yeah, we said that that has to be what it was. That yeah, has to be. They never they never mentioned that this fool was ever. He wasn't even near a computer uh -huh. in this in this movie. <laughs> nope. <laughs> he didn't even. I don't even think he knew what a computer was. Uh, in an interview with Grantland, John Singleton revealed he created the character of Tej after Ja Rule mm. refused to reprise his role from the first film. Yeah. Right. Man, they got a they got a Jamaican in here. This scene was for no reason at all, and, and he straight up just got a. I ain't even saying offensive, but just got a stereotypical cliche Jamaican because mm. the 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 cars go past them. You could hear the cars whizzing by. Like, bomba clot. <laughs> Do you remember that? Yeah. Yo, this guy. Bomba clot. Bomba clot. Which is inaccurate because in Miami they be Haitian. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Right, yeah. Black people be Haitian. Maybe, there. maybe Haitians say bomba clot. I don't know. No. Maybe they should, they should no, have. Because they do French. talk about going to little Haiti. Yeah, so maybe that's it. No. Should have should have had his ass saying, eat him out. Bomba clot. <laughs> Man, that's a white producer threw that in yeah, at the end. That, yeah. That's his voice doing I'm it. Not, not realizing they're supposed to be Haitian. Yeah. So that's Jamaicans that do that, man. Yeah. Jamaicans say bum but like. Right. Maybe Haitians do too. I don't nah, know. They don't yeah. say that. They're French, I don't know. Man. They, don't, they don't say that. <laughs> Somebody say, you know, whatever it is, get your black ass out the street. Right, yeah. How <laughs> <laughs> dare you shamble across the street? Yeah. <laughs> but you know that's whatever, racist whatever, whatever, around the corner? Get your black ass hey, out the street. Haitian, Jamaican, whatever. Get your black ass out the street, <laughs> God damn it. <laughs> <laughs> oh shit oh people there you go man I really did like the movie now I would still give it a rental cause, yeah, yeah. I, I would give it a high rental it was it was fun when, yeah. like, once it started being fun it didn't stop being fun yeah sure. matter of fact e yeah even from from the mo from the interrogation scene and when they lay it out to Brian this is what you want me to do and this is the guy who's going to be your partner and he's like you got to be kidding me yeah yeah. <laughs> in a way he punked that guy yeah I probably would like Cause I really, I did like Tokyo Drift, man. I did. I gave it a rental because of, like I said, the women with the the <laughs> issue with the female characters, and maybe because this is a little slightly better, I might would, would give this one a high rental. Mm. I, you know, a lot of people talk bad about these movies. I know they, man, say, but they always say this one is the lowest rated, and I was like, why? I like these these films, man. I mean, they're not great. They got a lot. They got some real slick, nice production in them. Mm -hmm. And uh, you know, it could be a little biased from knowing <laughs> these characters for so long, and me find. Finally, seeing the origin, right? The origin <laughs> story of them. So, yeah, yeah. I had I had fun. Yeah, with yeah, you. you're going back and rewatching Phase One. Yeah. <laughs> oh man. 